Hello everyone, welcome to Bargain Gaming, where we can play excellent games without busting our wallets. This is episode 46 of uh, Mountain Blade Warband, and we are currently in uh, Pen Kanak, and we just learned that Maronath, uh, which used to belong to the Batanians, uh, was taken over by the Northern Empire, right? And uh, was conquered by the Northern Empire, and then the people actually rebelled. So right now it is its own faction. So this represents an opportunity for us because they are very weak, you know. Uh, so what I'm thinking is, uh, I, I have saved. Okay, let us save the game, right? Let us save it to an earlier save. Say, say at two. Okay, let's save it there, right? And what I want to do is gather up uh, more, uh, what do you call this, uh, Valandians uh, knights. And hopefully we can actually... So I want to come down here. Uh, hmm. Right, I think... Can we pass over the mountains or no? Uh, what is the shortcut? Uh huh. I think. I th I think the northern the Landians they don't have knights. They've got uh, soldiers, right? They've got uh, uh, infantry people. I uh, so um hmm. So we need, I think, yeah, let's come down here. I think, yeah, I think the best way is to go through the bottom. And uh, gather more soldiers. Yeah, I think if we have, um, so I'm debating whether we should get more, uh, what do you call this, uh, archers versus... These are Batanian trained warriors. Uh, they are required XP to upgrade 900 points. Th they're ter tier 3, so they are not bad either. Uh, however, I'm trying to see if we can keep our requirements uh, simple or rather simpler. So that we are just dealing with a few number of troop types. How fast are we? See, the problem is, uh, we can get more archers. The problem with the archers is that it will slow down our movement speed on the world map. Okay, they just surrendered. <laughs> it's like, there are so many of us, and there are so few of them. Uh, okay. We're coming here to see if we can pick up... Oh, these are... Yeah, I, you know, archers are also good because uh, in a siege env environment, uh, we actually do need archers, and Batanian archers are very, very strong. Uh, hopefully, we can get uh, if if there are any to get, they will be like second tier. Oh, these are Batanian of of Valandians knights. Oh, they are Valandians. No light cavalry. No, we want the knights. So this is tier four, yes. Uh, what are these? Valandian gallant. Okay, Valandian. Ca no, no, gallants are part of the elite root troops. Gallants. Gallants. Knights. 
Okay, what are they selling? The other thing we need to do is... We need more food. I think we might be getting to the point... Oh, we have 531 days of food. So, okay, that's fine. Mm, can we sell them some of our... What do you call this? Uh, our wrought iron? Because we have too much wrought iron, uh, crude, oh, crude, no, 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 that's like giveaway price, no, um, hmm, okay, uh, we are at 112, right, uh, no, 104, see, it's hard to control this, here, if we have just, that's the kind of food we have, we have 90 grain. Oh, we need more beer. Date fruit. Oh, we have 90 days on food. Battle ready troops is 104. Out of how many? Uh, let's check how many. I'm excited to see if we can actually. Oh, we have. We can get up to 129. Oh, we got some looters. Valandian champion becomes, I think, they become a uh, champion. They become banner knights, right? We have 21 banner knights. Uh, these are archers. Okay, uh, done. So we need to gather more troops and hopefully... Why is this? I thought this is... Uh, why are they... Why are troops there a Valandian? Oh, culture is Valandia. Okay, uh, how about here? What's the culture of this village? Valandia, okay. Because if we have 129 and then we head into Marunath, I don't know if we can take it. It's going to be very hard, but you know what? Uh, if we don't try, we will never know if we can take it or not. So these are Valenian squires. No, we don't want those squires. Let's get the Gallant. Knight. Gallant. Yeah, these are too, they, they are too squishy. And what kind of products do they have? Olives. How much, how much olives do we have? Uh, olives, okay, we can get some more. Now that we have a big party, I think, yeah, food food can go away very quickly. Uh, I think there are porkers up here. Chomad. Okay, let's take these guys. So that we will get some experience. And then we can pass by Jakulan and then... You got a problem? Okay. Okay, yeah, hopefully we'll pick up... Uh, our Valandian Knights will pick up uh, experience. And let's keep... Uh, 
And whenever we fight them, we gather loot, and the loot that we, and the loot that we get under some uh, one of our leadership position, if we contribute them to the troops, they actually uh, become experience. They translate to experience. I mean, uh, gar uh, armor and weapons that we give to our troops. Look at that. Look at this number of knights. Whoa. Okay. Should we practice or should we give them all the uh... Oh, we just murdered them So picked up four guys and these are what I talk. About, I was I was uh, talking about. If we contribute this to our troops, they gain experience from that one. Okay, uh, I won't be doing that. I'm saving up a lot of loot. In fact, a lot of the swords that we have been making, we can actually just uh, make them and uh, contribute them to our troops. Because under under this, um, if we look at this. One of the perks that we took as our leadership, under our leadership uh, perk here, uh, or is it under our stewardship, or is it under here? Oh, okay. Uh, this one is 50% less influence cost. Okay. How about here? Wait, wait. What are what are these? Uh, when you clear a hideout, you gain plus three relationship with the nearest town owner clan. If it is you, increase town loyalty by one. Reduce item barter penalty with the lords of the same culture with you by 25%. Hiring mercenaries is 20% cheaper. Reduce item barter penalty with the lords of the different culture with you 10%. Oh, I don't know what that means. Uh, reduce the item barter penalty with lords of the same culture with you by 25. Uh, when you clear a, a hideout, you gain with the nearest town owner clan. If it is you, increase town loyalty by one. I think that's better. Hiring, no, we don't really need that. Reduce item barter penalty with the lords of the different culture with you by... Reduce item barter penalty with the lords of the different culture with you by 10. Reduce the item barter... The first item doesn't really... The first part, we want this. It will increase the talent loyalty by one. Reduce item barter penalty with the lords of the same culture with you by 25. Yeah, but the clan is smaller, right? If, if we join a faction, I think this is better. Although the first line doesn't really do us any good. Reduce item barter penalty with the lords of different culture with you by 10%. Let's pick this one. Okay. Uh, oh, and we gain one point. Okay. Uh, so are we? Oh, we're maxed out here. Do we want to keep maxing out our, or do we want to max out our trade? Oh, we have a, quite a ways with trade. I think let's keep on here. What? No, 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 no. How do we cancel it? That is such a small increase. Um, no, no, we don't want to do that. No, we don't want to do that. Okay. Uh, so we're maxed out then, as, as far as uh, crafting is concerned. Um, where is that charm, right? That's in charm area? Yeah. Uh... Reduce item bar penalty with lords of different, yeah. And I think this is the one we should improve 
because um, okay how about this one hmm. yeah this is uh, leadership we're maxed out we max it out this is maxed out yeah we will do a lot of bartering and who else has leveled up that's Niasen I think we will soon put it here maybe because he's got 10 in engineering and he will be with us most of the time um, wow he's maxed out here uh huh no no I think we want to max this out his learning is right 6.25 we're maxed out here huh yeah there's no point increasing it because he has a, a ways to go huh okay anyway um, let's come to Jakulan go to the tavern let's trade to see if we have throwing daggers nope light bolts no uh, horse paladin no Oh yeah, tribesmen. Ooh, just three of them. A lowland uh, olives, fish. Uh, let's come over here. We will see that we have. So we're continuing to make money and it's a large bag of javelins, heavy bolts, crafted. Um, hmm. And then let's look at the food stuff. Oh, they have a lot of pork, right? Uh, they have olives. Wow, oh, olives. And yeah, they have a lot of olives and we are okay in olives i think yeah we're okay in okay in olives uh, yeah we cannot have we, we bring too much with us and we will be load bogged down by too much food and Can we sell some? Ooh, we can sell some of these. Crude iron, yes. Because this is so heavy. And they are giving us a good price for it. Right? Okay. Yes. And we have 58 porkers with us, which we can convert to food if we want to. Uh, enter the smithy. We're all tuckered out. I mean, yeah, our people are all tired out. Okay, um, that means we need to wait for some time here. Middle of the night. Start of ev evening and then 
three quarters. Okay. Who are these guys over here? Oh, he's gonna take these uh, sea raiders. Okay, again, let's just, uh, yeah, send in everyone and hopefully some of the new gallants that we picked up can go up in rank. Horse archers! Attack! Look at that. Look at that massive amount. See, the, so on the field, I think we will be very strong. A problem is I am worried that going up again in the, on the castle uh, as, uh, as an attacking force, uh, these guys are not uh, level f uh, at the sixth tier yet. So... They won't be as strong as the Sweden Knights. Now, if they're as strong as the Sweden Knights, then we don't have an issue. Where? Uh, yeah, there are no, uh... Okay, let's head in the other direction. Ideally, we should be scouting around in this vicinity for those sea raiders like we saw earlier like there were 22 of them yeah this guy just fought the sea raiders Lasan. let's look at what composition he has oh we can't see here wow this militia is 255 so we got about 500 a garrison of yeah okay let's enter the smithy Uh, let's check on smelting. Do we have things that we can smelt? Okay, not much. Okay, what we can do is refine uh, items so that we can get everybody to refining items. No. Refined items. This one, yeah. Okay. Uh, we're trying to get rid of our crude iron, turn them into wrought iron.
See, I was for for a while there. I was planning that we should also start trying to get all the recipes or finish out the 200 uh, sword recipes, and then uh, that's when the incident with the um, with Mar Maronath came out, and I said so. I started getting greedy. I said, hey, maybe we should uh, go and take this guy out, and uh, in that process. Hopefully gain ourselves a castle Okay, uh, what I'll do is continue to um, Pick up more troops until we hit the maximum cap of 129 which is our current maximum anyway uh, our timer went off so Let me cut the episode right here. Thank you guys for joining me. I hope you join me in the next episode. Bye